we've talked a lot about AI being framed as both a risk and an, and an opportunity. When it comes to financial institutions, which are having a systemic role in our, in our world, how can those institutions manage the public perception while extracting value of AI and still minimizing the risk? How do you see it evolving? So financial service institutions in general, I think is data control and is, I think we say central, and that requires effectively new governance methods with property we have not seen before. We are used to control the data quality and there are various layers of checks and controls which occur. And of course, the information is at the financial services, banking, asset management, insurance, the information is always at the base of the, the, the decision-making process. So the quality of the data has to be good. But what we have not seen in the, in the past is that you want to control the data that uses an input by a machine to then do that. And that process requires uh, a little bit more attention than uh, just having good data. You want the machine to point out to the right data. And that is fundamental because the Generative AI model, for example, which uses a much larger data set than what you provide, can be limited that way. Machine learning in itself, and everybody who has done a little bit of it, will tell you that already the selection of the data or the structure and structure format that is provided truly changes the, the output quality. And so never like before, we had to be sure about what is used in order to inform the machine and get the information right than before. And that translates into a, a, a big risk for those who are in a risk management uh, position or in a compliance position, because ultimately the governance that, that comes out of, the, of that is sometimes is not in the same hands of those who have to go and, and check it. So I think that's where the the information truly is, the, the, the real change is that in the process of structuring a, a re or reorganizing in order to use these tools, a bank or anybody else who's operating in the sector will have to take into account that whatever data is used is fundamental and so the whole process to either generate store and understanding where it's going and, and pointing out that triggers the whole explainability issue that you mentioned earlier and, and makes it valid or any process of hallucination whatever it is that they're looking at the data is going to be by far the, the most important component and i don't think that at times i, I see that people talk about ai thinking that AI can do a lot of things, which it can, but AI relies on information and that information needs to be correctly calibrated in order to reach that. Now, it doesn't sound that new as an issue. Anybody who's working risk management will concur with this statement that for decades we've been looking about, we're talking about the data. What I'm saying is that now the process of how this is digested also is the extra layer. And so the, the governance process needs to be much more consolidated. It is a risk that even the board should take into account. On top of uh, cybersecurity and everything else that comes with technology, the data generation and the data availability and the data com componentability, it's key for anything that is AI.